yeah i have completed the uh, total video and make the admin route you see this is my complete project so let's see as e if i do this video piece by piece basis it will be a large chunk of files so i have completed and make you understand what i have done over here and i will give you the uh, github repository so that's so you will be able to see the file and work by your own way okay so i have completed the i have completed the protect, protection of my routes you see it's private route if i want wanna go to admin route it's redirect, redirect me, redirecting me to the login page so let's try um, let's try by uh, normal user say ping key is the normal user she is the normal user you see his role is a normal user okay user so he is not supposed to navigate to the admin page but in his but he can register to the login or register page and i am logging out so i am showing you another user who has the admin permission or authority like shakil this is me gmail dot com and you see I'm the admin you see see the user role it's the admin so I can navigate to the admin route okay so route is fully protected normal user cannot navigate to that place but admin user can do that so what I have done over here uh, first of all in the previous video i have created the register api and register page you, you will give you will get the full uh full uh, you will get the full uh, repository github repository okay so no worries yeah you can and what you need to do just go to the next config js file and give you necessary mongo uri next auth secrets google client id and everything so at, at, as this is my private so i am not giving you so but you need to mongo uri otherwise it will not work okay mongo uri next auth secrets give you random secrets google client id your personal client id or client though i have uh, done only credentials let's see credentials mm, next auth go to next auth this is the main file who is uh, protecting the routes this and uh, middleware file okay i'm showing you middleware file later so this is the main file here we have credential provider okay so we have connected our db and find on from the password you see the user is coming from the backend password we have the backend file and and for callbacks it will give you additional attributes you see uh, we are getting we are getting the extra metadata like role name this is for callbacks okay give it callbacks and this is credential provider we have several providers like google provider github provider credential providers okay so for credential provider uh, we are uh, finding the user from the backend you see it's the user is coming from the backend okay okay and finally what we did to we, uh, we protecting our routes by the middle layer you see if the role is not admin this line is saying that if the role uh, if the route is not a start with admin and his role is not admin he will be redirected to the home page okay and matchers we are giving the matchers so if he wanna go to admin path he or she must be admin okay so these two file are protecting our routes 
on is next auth and another is middle layer okay and these are the pages you see login page oh another thing i did i am doing it i am getting the api call from the context auth context you see i am providing the api call from here so i am making the api call from here and so it's retrieving uh, it's post request okay so it's register okay only register it's post request and in the register page we are connecting with the auth context okay and in the auth context we have register user you see the register user this is register user we are sending name email password and it retrieving from the uh, on chains e dot target dot value okay and same with the login page login page we are doing the same login we are uh, creating login page through next auth um, you see this is the sign in page credentials club um, if uh, something does not match it will redirect us to the home page okay so i will give you all the files so what i did i did next auth for protecting our routes we have created two files one is next auth another another one is middleware so i hope you will understand as uh, if i make it piece by piece basis it will be a uh, huge video we need five or six six videos more so i am completing it i am completing the code make the web, uh, website full functional you see and i am showing you everything the code and i am also giving you the code so if i log in i can also register you see if i register say let's say khalid I registered you and I, if I want to check in the MongoDB you see Khalid will be here you see this is Khalid and only on and only user is admin you see this is admin this is normal user this is normal user and this is normal user so anyone anyone with say I have created Khalid Khalid he is the normal user okay you see the normal user so he is restricted to visit the admin page so he cannot go to the admin page but he can navigate to register login and everything so if i log out and register by the admin user with admin permission you see shaki gmail.com see he is the head admin you see admin so he can navigate to the admin page okay so this admin route is fully protected so if i log in and try to navigate to the admin without register or login then he is it is redirecting us to the login page no one can navigate to the admin page so these are file and everything next dot register route login route and the main file is the middleware you see in the middleware so in the middleware file i am saying that if anyone is 
or not admin he, he is not supposed to visit the admin path okay and finally i am give, giving you another reminder you have to configure the mongo url you have to give the url next of secrets otherwise it will not work okay so it's as it is secret so i am not providing you but how you can get the mongo url i can show you uh, let's say database go to database and connect connection this is the connection URL you see this is the connection URL you have to copy it and paste it over here okay so this is all about for me and it's fully functional hope you have enjoyed the video so if you like the video please like share and subscribe and give a big, give give me a big thumbs up I will come up with a lot of videos tutorial videos so i'm sorry for being late for some days i was a bit busy with some specific jobs but i will visible and give a lot of tutorial video in my youtube channel stay connected and give your friends know that a lot of tutorial videos are over here give you, give me a big thumbs up thank you very much see you soon